everyone, it's Karen with Yes Please Paper Crafts. And in this video, I'm going to be doing an unboxing, but it's going to be a little bit different than the other unboxings that I've done on my channel because I didn't purchase scrapbooking or paper crafting supplies, which is probably a big shock to you guys. <laughs> but um, I did find uh, this small business and I wanted to support them. And uh, so I'll tell you a little story about how I actually found Holly. I was researching uh, packing and packing supplies and packaging orders because I am starting my own online store, which I just launched recently. And uh, so I was watching videos on YouTube and I came across Holly's videos where she packages her soap. And so what's in this order is handmade soaps. And uh, so anyway, I got to watching Holly's videos and I just kept watching and watching. She's so much fun to watch and listen to when she packs up her orders. And I just love all of the attention to detail that she brings to uh, everything that she does. And uh, so anyway, I got addicted to watching her and she's just super fun to listen to. And uh, then I started watching her soap making videos and I was just fascinated by those as well. I just love the creative process of making soap. I've never seen anyone do that before. And uh, this <laughs> really looks like a lot of fun. Now, I don't know if it's something I would do because it does look like it's a lot of hard work and, you know, having to wear protective clothing uh, just to make sure you don't get any lye on you. Uh, but I love the creative process of how Holly mixes the colors and creates different tops on her soaps. And it's just fascinating. So anyway, I'm going to put a link to Holly's channel in the description below. So if you want, you can go and check out her videos. Uh, but I did open this up just to um, kind of take a peek. I haven't actually dug into the box yet. And I wanted to make sure you couldn't see, you know, address and stuff on there. So I did... Uh, kind of just go in there and uh, <laughs> take a peek. My invoice is in there, but I covered that up too. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, just go ahead and unbox this. I'm super excited. Now I'm going to do the unboxing, and but before I post the video up to YouTube, I want to have the opportunity to use some of Holly's soap. And so I think what I'm going to do is uh, make this video into two parts. I'll do the unboxing, then I'm going to take a shower later and use some soap, and then I'm going to come back and kind of let you guys know uh, what my thoughts are on the soap. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look. So she gave me a sample, and it's the Cranberry Kiss. And I know she left me a little note down here, a personal note, because I asked her if she could possibly give me a sample of her Figgy Cream Soap, because it's one of the ones that Every time she talks about it, it's one of her favorites. I really wanted to buy that, but she didn't have any in her shop. And so I asked her if she has any samples, if she could send them over, and she said that she didn't. But she did include this Cranberry Kiss. And uh, so that's really awesome. That smells so good. She always usually gives samples in all of her packages, which I think is really cool. Okay, then she also has her business card here. And here's her website, which is moriversoap.com. And she's from Missouri, and uh, so I think that's really cool. Okay, then we have some shred here. <laughs> I'm just going to take all of this out. She does a really good job of packaging everything and making sure that it arrives to you safely. And I just really appreciate that. Okay. Oh, she sent me another sample. How awesome is that? Pumpkin Spice Latte. Ooh, that one smells really awesome. <laughs> oh my goodness. I wish there was a smell of vision so y'all could smell how good this smells. <laughs> okay. Now, I did want to also try one of the bath bombs, uh, but they didn't have a scent that I thought I would like. And so I'm going to wait to try the bath bomb uh, for another time. But I did go ahead and pick up one of these... Uh, this is the oatmeal milk bath. It's bubbling bath salts. And I thought that sounded like it would be a lot of fun to try. And uh, so I'm going to try to, to take a bubble bath and see how this works out. <laughs> All right, let's see what else we have here. Okay, so I also got this soap here, which is the Luscious Lemon. Oh my goodness, that smells so good. Now, I got this one for my mom. My mom loves lemons. So some of these soaps that I purchased are gifts for other people in my family. 
see if I can open this up without destroying the package because I really want to see the soap inside. <laughs> but it's not letting me. <laughs> okay, maybe I'll try I'll, maybe I'll try another one. <laughs> Isn't that pretty? I just love that. Okay, the next one that I got here is for my sister Terry. This one is called the Ice Eucalyptus. And my sister loves the um, eucalyptus scented soaps over at Bath and Body Works. So I thought she might enjoy this one. And I just love uh, all of the different uh, designs that Holly does. And uh, let's see if I can open this one. I don't know. Maybe I can't open this one either. <laughs> oh, here we go. Woo! We got it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's gorgeous. Look at that. So pretty. <laughs> That is just really, really pretty. I love the color. Aqua and teal is my favorite colors, and I just love all the swirls. That is just so awesome. And it also smells amazing. <laughs> okay, so let's see what else we have in here. I think I got five soaps in uh, one of the bath salts. And I'm definitely going to be ordering more for Christmas gifts. And uh, this one is the Maple Leaves. I watched Holly do a video where she made this soap, and it was so pretty. It had um, a topper on it with little uh, cutout leaves. She she makes it look so easy when she opens these boxes, but <laughs> I just don't want to tear the box. And it's catching on there. Let's see if I can do it from the bottom. Nope. <laughs> Holly, if there's a trick on how to open these boxes, I sure would like to know. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> see it's catching right here, so it's in there really snug. And uh, I know I'm gonna tear it. Look, I tore it. I'm gonna be keeping this one for myself, I guess. Goodness. There we go. <laughs> I really wanted to see the top on this soap. <laughs> okay, so this is the maple leaf soap. It's also got the swirl design, and it's got the colors of autumn, which I think is so pretty. And then on the top is the uh, cut leaves. So she does what's called an embed, and she embeds these uh, uh, leaves in there. And I just think that is super pretty. And that one also smells amazing. Oh my goodness, I can't wait to use some of the soap when I take my shower later. <laughs> okay. The next one we have is this one, which is called the Patchouli Rain. Oh my goodness, that smells incredible. Let's see if I can open up this box. There we go. Okay, so this one is the Patchouli Rain. It's so pretty. And the top is kind of like a, you know, just like a drizzle top. And it has the... Uh, I don't know what you call that, the design on there. It's like a swirl design, I guess. And that one smells good too. Okay, so I love that one. So we have one more. So it looks like I had five soaps. And then I also got uh, the melt bath. So this is the smooches. Uh, which is another one. Uh, this I love the colors of this one. That's really pretty. Let's see if I can open this box without tearing it. I might cut out some of the part of this video where I'm opening these boxes because, to be honest, it's taken me forever to figure out how to get into them without tearing it. <laughs> and I really want to open it. <laughs> Here, I got it. Okay, so this one is called the Smooches, and I think this was the only one that I got with the Eco Glitter, and I think that's so pretty. <laughs> Look at that. That's really cute. I love the sparkle on the top there, and uh, the design is super pretty as well. Okay, Holly, you did an amazing job on all of these soaps, and it's just so much fun to watch how you make them, and then be able to order them and get them to use and to give as a gift. So I just want to say thank you for making the videos. And uh, I think it's really awesome that you do that because uh, it really does show how much you care about what you do and how much you love soap making. And I can see that in every video that you make. And when you package your orders with such care, it's just amazing. 
And so um, I'm definitely going to be uh, placing another order for to get some Christmas gifts. And hopefully I might pick up some of that figgy cream soap and a bath bomb. <laughs> so, all right. Okay, so I'm going to come back after I've had a chance to use the soaps and let you guys know what I think. But based on what I've seen so far and how awesome these smell, I think that I'm going to really love using them. Okay, so I'm back. For y'all, it was probably about a couple seconds. For me, it's been a whole week, uh, maybe a little bit longer than that. I have been using one of the soaps that I got from Holly over at Missouri River Soap, and I have truly been enjoying it. I think the soap is awesome. It has, a, it has a really nice scent, but it's not overpowering. It's a very creamy soap. It has a lot of uh, foam to it. And I have sensitive skin, and I used it without any problems at all. So I was really excited about uh, trying out Holly Soap. And I would definitely recommend y'all going out there and checking out what she has in her store. And hopefully she's going to be having some more soap coming out soon. I will put a link to Holly's... Uh, website in the description of this email and I also wanted to share with you guys that um, she does give samples and uh, I did get two samples from her when I placed this order uh, one was for the pumpkin spice latte the other was from for the cranberry kiss and it's a really nice size sample and I'm going to be putting this one in my bathroom to use as a hand soap and it smells so good. This one's Cranberry Kiss. <laughs> okay, so I know this was a little bit of a different type of video for me to post on my channel, uh, but I did want to support other small businesses, and I really love watching Holly's videos. So if you've never seen anyone make soap, or if you like watching soap making videos, please be sure to check out her YouTube channel. And uh, y'all stick around to the end of this video because I have a short video clip of my two dogs, Bella and Lily Bell, for you guys. And I'm going to be having some more scrapbooking and organization videos coming up on my channel soon. So I did take some time off to spend time with some family that was visiting from out of town and also to fulfill some orders that I received from my button shop. And I do want to say thank you to everyone who has placed an order. I really do appreciate that. And so uh, that's all I have. So y'all take care, have an awesome day, and hope to see you next time. Bye now. Hi, Miss Bella. Hi, Miss Bella. Did we get some happy mail today? We did. Yeah, we got soap. We got handmade soaps all the way from Missouri. Yeah. yeah. I know, we didn't get you any. <laughs> there, there was no doggy soap available. No doggy soap. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> well, I can still give you a bath. I just have to use your doggy shampoo. Yeah? You, <laughs> you want the good handmade stuff? <laughs> Is that what you're telling me? Well, I'm sorry, but Miss Holly, she doesn't make hand handmade doggy shampoo. <laughs> she doesn't make that. But her soaps are awesome, and they smell really good. I know. Miss Lily Bell. Miss Lily Bell, what do you got to say about it? Hmm? Do you have anything to say? <laughs> oh, Miss Bella, you're going to do all the talking today? Yeah, you're going to do all the talking? No. <laughs> well, it seems like you are. <laughs> Can you say hi to the YouTube people? Lily Bell, can you say hi to the YouTube people? No. <laughs> can you say hi? Okay, what did that mean? <laughs> Can you say, <laughs> you're gonna pelt? <laughs> Are you gonna say hi? Are you gonna be nice and say hi? Miss Bella, can you speak? Miss Bella, can you speak? <laughs> can y'all say hi to the YouTube people? You can't, why not? I think you should at least say hi. You don't think so? <laughs> yeah? 
Because you didn't get any handmade soap? Is that why you're upset? I'm sorry. If she makes some doggy shampoo, I will buy it for you, okay? Alright? I promise. So can you say hi now? No? <laughs> Lily Bell, can you say hi? Can you speak? Lily Bell, can you speak? Can you speak? Can you speak? Say woof woof. Lily Bell, woof woof. Miss Bella, is it dinner time? Ah! It is. Ah! Is that why you're upset? <laughs> you think it should be dinner time? Miss Bella, what are you up to, Missy? Are you being a good girl? Ah! You are? Can you say hi to the YouTube people? And we have a visitor, Miss Mariah's over here. And <laughs> she's standing up. That is just too funny. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, you're too funny. Do you think you're a human being? <laughs> you're so sweet. Are you a sweet girl? Yes, you are. You're a sweet girl. Uh huh. <laughs> That's too funny. She's staying with me for a week. The other day I was laying down and I look over and I was half asleep and I look over and she was standing like that, looking up at me, trying to get my attention, I guess. <laughs> All right. Okay, girls, should I feed y'all dinner? Should I feed you dinner? Huh? Yeah? I should. I should. Can you say bye to all the YouTube people? Bella, can you say goodbye? Can you speak? Miss Bella, can you speak? No. <laughs> okay, well, I guess I'll have to say goodbye for you. <laughs> oh, y'all gonna be sweet to each other. <laughs> y'all are funny. <laughs> okay, so I guess we'll say goodbye. Hope y'all have an awesome week, and we shall see you next time. Bye now.